Iron Marks. It's not looking good, is it? I've had better days. <laughs> so are you. Name's Carson, but we'll get to that. You and I are on the same side, by the way. Right. But don't I get a lawyer? You don't need a lawyer. But you do need my help. Oh, for fuck's sake. You seem to have forgotten in all this excitement that you were in some serious shit. Look around you, Ryan. This is it. This is the rest of your life, sitting in a fucking room. Come on, play it out. You're facing multiple life sentences. Terrorism, conspiracy, more murders than we could even count. So you don't want to talk? Okay. Let me tell you what I know. Marks. SAS Nomad Squadron. Zero. This is Nomad 2 1. I've reached the compound. Going in. Over. Nomad 2 1, this is Zero. Negative. Wait for close air support. Over. Zero, I'm the one on the ground. I'm telling you, we need to extract now. Negative, hold position, over. Hello, Nomad 2-1, this is Zero. You are green, on to go, over. Roger that. Weapon good.
basic training all over again. Just grab the ladder.
down. Take that long. Just need to use my tools. Fucking with my mind. This place plays tricks on you.
Da mal eine Warte. Of your unit. Buy my fucking ball bag of rags, you bastard. Sounds like I'm in the right place. Oh, you've got Verni. Reinforced. Looks like I'm going in loud. You'll be anything left of you once I finish. Prime the charge. Scared marks. I thought I was gonna have to rescue myself. Oh, fair enough. I'll be off then, shall I? <laughs> you fucker, come on. Get these up. Ah! <sighs> 
Give me a compass estimation. Route in. I had eyes on seven to ten x-rays with longs and five x-rays with shorts. Best estimate. Okay, go. Comms check. Roger that. Weapon check. Ammo good. Weapon good. Safety off? Always. Firm. Move. Firm. Move. nest out there, mate. Stand by. Stand by. Stand by. Go. Get in. Get in. Go. Barrier, brace yourself. This is nice, man. You should get one. If you ever get your license back. <laughs> Fuck off. Oh, these fuckers aren't going to give up without fight, mate.
Got some bad news, I'm afraid. Unfortunately, your dad died. Your dad died. Your dad died. Your dad died. Heart attack. Over really quickly. There's nothing anyone could have done. I'm really sorry, mate. Flight's arranged. So get your bags packed. You're going back to London. London Street. Gary with a small leg. Yeah. <laughs> Looks even smaller now. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I used to get them right up about that. <laughs> In fairness, you did say it looked like uh, great with a face. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <yeah>. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck is that? I quit smoking. And carbs. Carbs? Yeah. Do you know what apple was basically one big carb? <laughs> so I've given up fruit. Well, what about beer? Uh, beer's not fruit, it's grain. <laughs> yeah, try it. See yourself. How you been? Yeah, you know me. And how's mum doing? She just lost her husband. How do you think she's doing? Yeah. <laughs> Was fucking sudden, mate. Don't think it's hit her yet. I don't think it's any of us. Mm. Look, he was no angel, but I just thought he'd make it through to the end. No one big enough to take him on. Things are running smoothly. Better than this. Still, better than a bullet in the head, I suppose. Heart attack doesn't sound too fun. Yeah. Probably right. Goes to show though, doesn't it? No so what? Oh, I don't fucking know. Something profound. <laughs> <laughs> it's good to see you, mate. Yeah. Good to see you too. Great. Over with. Yeah. You ready? Yeah. I'm ready. Come on then. I won't ask you about the funeral. We're no stranger to those. I just want to know what happened afterwards. It's easy to say a guy comes back from the army. Goes nuts, right? Seen too much, can't handle it, case closed. But we both know that's bullshit.
Cool story. We should write a book. My life as a massive dickhead. I might give you a chapter. If you would tell me something. Okay, I'll tell you something. Go fuck yourself. I mean, who's in charge here? <clears throat> I'll speak to them. Ryan. I am ex-Delta. We both know the same things. I'm here to help. You need to help me. Ah, oh, ex-Delta does pop psychology. You gonna ask me what I dreamt about last night? Sure. What'd you dream about last night, Ryan? Oh, I was doing a speech naked, then all my teeth fell out. Do you think that means? This is a conversation. I'm not a cop. I'm not here to go after your family business. In fact, I don't give a shit about any of that. I know you're not a cop, because you've got CIA written all over you. Delta, really? Come on. It's just a fucking desk jockey. <laughs> is that what you think? Yeah, it is. Intel, analysis, mission reports will only take you so far. But if you want the reality of a tactical situation, you need to be on the ground. We both know that. Ground truth. Exactly. How many made it from your unit selection? Five. Plus you? Including me. They don't always take the best guy, but they always take the right guy. Wow. Was there a cliche test? I failed mine. Dog ate my homework. <laughs> <sighs> All right, Delta Force. You've convinced me. We can talk. Okay. Good. Take care of it. Thanks, Clint. Oh, it's good to have you back. How are you? Terrible. You? Oh, you know. Wonderful service. Flowers were lovely. Your dad would have hated it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Mum, it might be a good time to start thinking about yourself. Get out of this. You go on a cruise, get a caravan. <laughs> caravan? I can't just leave. People counting on me. What about Nick and Michelle? Mum, Nick's 34 years old. I think it'd be all right. <laughs> you know what I mean. I'm serious. Maybe you should step away. Dad wouldn't want you worrying about the business. You know what your dad would have wanted? Everyone to get out so he could watch the snooker. <laughs> he was so proud of you. You know that, don't you? I know. God, you look just like him. He wasn't much younger than you when we met. When was that? 1937. He was a lot funnier than you, though. <laughs> What's going on? Ah, stay behind me. Get in! They're all over us. All right, all right. Ah! Put the weapons down. Now! Oh, fuck. Clint, do as she says. Don't move. Listen, love. You don't know who the fuck you're dealing with. Just put the gun. Fuck. Okay, it's clear. He moved. Anne, do you know I am? <laughs> yeah, of course you do. 
For those of you that don't, my name is Anthony Sharp. I'm a businessman. And like all good businessmen, I like to seek out new opportunities. For fuck's sake. I've just buried my husband. Yeah, I know. And it's a terrible thing. But like I said, new opportunities. The thing is, it's very difficult getting you all together. And my offer is for the whole family. Yeah, can we hurry this up, Tone? I've got a date tonight. You open your fucking mouth again! And I'm gonna put a bullet through her face! What is it you want? What do I want? Your operation. All of it. Networks, assets. Oh, come on, I don't need to tell you how this works. You've done it plenty of times yourselves. You just keep on doing what you're doing. Think of it as... A merger. Apart from you. You can fuck off back to the army. And I know what you're thinking. You're tempted to push back. But I strongly advise against that. I don't want this to be a hostile takeover. I'm sure you don't. I've got a lot of respect for you, Anne. You're a clever woman. You'll do the right thing. All right. Well, I think I'm just about done here. This is my brother Keach. He is the absolute best with numbers. And he's gonna make sure that this transition runs smoothly. Right. I need ledgers, receipts, contact books, diaries, you name it. I wanna know when you last saw your fucking proctologist. Come on, chop chop. Someone clear that up. The Sharp Brothers. They've done well for themselves. I get why they want your family business. I mean, it's the best network in Europe, but it's an area they have zero expertise in. Do you have a history with Tony? Yeah, we knew him. He had his thing, we had ours. Well, he's never a problem. So why now? He saw an opportunity. An opportunity? Mm. On the day of your dad's funeral? That guy is a total asshole. We've done worse. Mm. You're right. We have. Oh! <laughs> There was one thing we've all been wondering. What's that? How the fuck did you get out of there? <laughs> <laughs> How many are there? Six, maybe eight. I tell you what, this accountancy lark is hard fucking going. <sighs> what a prick. I'm gonna do him. Nick. Might try some of this scotch. Celebrate our new union. <laughs> Who's gonna pour it for me? How about one of the Marx brothers? Here. Which one's Groucho? <laughs> <laughs> now that's actually pretty good. Yeah. Did you hear that, Ryan? Our surname's Marx, and we're brothers. So that makes us the Marx brothers. Did <laughs> <laughs> you just think of that, kid? <laughs> <laughs> or you, Annie. Go on. Have a little drink with me. <laughs> we could do shots. <laughs> Won't be doing any shots with that. Hey? <laughs> Safety's on. Hey? No, hey? <laughs> Mark's family in action. Talk about a well oiled machine. That's some serious gangster shit right there. So, what comes next? What would you have done? I would retrench, talk to my people, make sure I could trust them. Gather resources, head somewhere to plan the counterattack. Somewhere safe. Got some gangster shit of your own there, Carson. I thought we'd never shut up. Right, we need to get out. Fire escape. Nothing? Okay, keep me updated. Sharp's got to be somewhere. Still no sign then. I should be wearing that awful headset. You starting a cab firm or something? Dick. <laughs> what have we got? Tony's been approaching some of our people. Most of them just told him to fuck off. Someone's helped him. Find out who. Safe houses? All good. Warehouse is secure. Scott's on his way to the courtyard now. We'll take care of the rest of it. And Clint. Someone needs to tell Sarah and the kids. We're on it. 
Be sure they looked after. That American bird. What do we know? She's military. Professional. No wonder you shit yourself. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you're not wrong. No one knows anything about her. It's weird. You can't... Hold on. Go ahead. We need to talk about what we do next. We give him a slap in terms of fucking behave. He's just trying it on because Dad's gone. No, he's gone way too far for that. He's not going to start an all-out war. He's not big enough. Well, he clearly thinks he is big enough. We need to push back hard or we're finished. Tony's got to go. Got it. Thanks. We know where Tony's going to be tonight. Private party at his casino. Great. You might as well be on fucking Mars. Yeah, he'll be surrounded by his best people. Then the last thing he'll expect is me turning up. No way, Ryan. You are keeping well out of this. It could work. No, it's madness. Could you do it? I can do it. Did you hear what I just said? You are not getting involved. But I'm already involved. I could be in and out of there before anyone knows what's happened. I deal with situations and people a lot heavier than Tony Sharp. Ryan's right. What the fuck are you thinking? Tony won't stop here. We know that. Mum, Ryan's trained for this. Anyone else, you wouldn't think twice. But it isn't anyone else, is it, Nicholas? It's your brother. Okay, okay, fine. At least we know where Tony will be tonight. We can keep an eye where he goes afterwards and then pick our moment. Why risk waiting? If we've got a chance to take him down, we should do it. All right. But the first sign of trouble, Ryan, we get you out of there. Of course. What weapons we got? Let's have a look. Follow me. That's first safe house. <sighs> I haven't been in here since I was a kid. Don't think we need this place again. Good job we kept it though, hey? Yeah. Come on. Let's go and shoot some guns.
Gonna need to stay in radio contact. I'll go and find you an earpiece. When you're ready, head for the casino. I'll see you there. I think I'm gonna need some explosives. I'll see what I can do.
inside. This place is crawling with Tony's dodgy mates. Okay, in and out as fast as we can. You obviously didn't hit him hard enough. Roger that. Thank you. 
Listen up, everyone. Mr. Sharp won't be attending tonight after all. He wants the night to be a success. So act like he's still the guest of honor and behave yourselves. Right, did you hear that? Tony's not even fucking here. Tony's not here. But Keech is. in the basement. When the time's right, I'll cut the power. Good. I'll wake the casino. Make sure you're out before I trigger it. Keech is heading to the lifts. Copy. found him. Room 53. And shutting down power now. Cameras are offline. Time to go.
Michelle, get your C4 planted. You remember how I taught you? Of course. Placing the charge? Yep. Inserting the detonator. Yep, good. Careful. Press the red button. Okay, it's on. Nice one. Now get out. Okay, I'm heading to the car. Brian, be careful. Regulations. Tony likes it done by the book. Then why let Keats run the place? Slimy bastard. Maybe, but he's not stupid. Let's finish off the search. the C4. Now the detonator. Detonator in place. Red button to activate. Activated. Needs a good spread of C4 around the room. something. Perfect spot. Shoot me now! Come on! Shoot me now! Oh fuck 
looking at ya! Here comes the crack shot! Stay knife! There's a little prick now! Now let's go talk to Keach. See what we can find out about Tony. Try the lift. It should still be working. Fuck me, look what I found.
a little prick now. Stop fucking around and come in. Room 53. Ryan, we need him alive. All right, Keech, remember me. Oh, shit. Really? Get someone on five! He's trying to kill me! Shoot him! Shoot him! Out the fucking way, you idiot! Don't just stand there! That could have been... He's coming for me! He's catching up! Oh, God. Don't shoot Ryan. He can lead up all right, all right. Where's Tony? I don't know. I'm just his brother. He never tells me anything. Bullshit. I swear, I don't know. Don't lie to me. I don't fucking know, all right? Teach. Listen, I... I barely see him these days. He spends all his time with his special yeah, friends. Frank, you better... Don't let the box! Moving. Attention everyone. Mr. Sharp won't be on site at all tomorrow. He's planning on going to his art gallery again, but not till late. No bunking off in the meantime. Interesting. Ryan, I've got guards blocking my exit. I need a distraction. Roger that.
Right. What have we got here? Nice one. some noise!
fucking board with this. You gonna let me kill you or what? <coughs> Leave it to him. There's a little prick now. Guys, I'm heading for the door. I'll see you at the car. Shit, they've clocked me. Take her down! Take her down! I've got your back, Michelle. You're clear! Nick! Don't wait for me. I'll cover you. Man down. Request urgent assistance. Time to blow this you and me, Marty. I'm in the alley with the car, Ryan. Hurry! Michelle, keep the engine running. I'm on my way. I just gotta say, you don't fuck around. In for a penny. All right. Now we're getting somewhere. Tony threatens you on the day of your dad's funeral. You decide no deal? Yeah. So now you're in a war. You go to the casino to find him. He's not there, but his brother is. Oh, his brother? Oh, I can't remember. Sure. <laughs> so you blew the place sky high. No, there was a gas explosion. Oh, yeah. And no one got hurt either. That was lucky. Yeah, really lucky. <laughs> 
So Tony told you not to push back. His casino goes up in a fireball, and his brother's dead. Is that it? Mm, oh, I think I broke a window. Really? Was it worth it? Did you find anything? Yeah. Okay, good. And? Well, after the casino, I thought it was time for some culture. Culture? Mm-hmm. Cool. Can you sit, please? You're making my neck sore. <laughs> sure. Worst nights in the casino. Yeah, that got out of hand real fucking quickly. The plan was to kill Tony, not his brother. Accidents happen. Well, Tony was supposed to be there. Have some good information, sis. Fuck off. Well, he certainly knows he's in a war now. What did you find out? Tony's art gallery. He seems to be spending a lot of time there. Tony Sharp, patron of the arts. Fuck it, now. It's all about his ego. He wants respectability. By the looks of it, a new exhibition. We need to figure out what he's really up to. Yeah. I'm gonna go and find out. You're just gonna walk in there? Oh, I got it. Why don't you take a beret and an easel and then you can really blend it? <laughs> yeah. Try these. How do I look? Wait. Where did Ryan go? <laughs> it was right there. I was just talking to him. <laughs> Fucking hell, bruv. Ryan Marks, man of a thousand faces. <laughs> I teach you that in the army. All right, all right. You need to get into that gallery and see what's happening. Yeah, I'm on it. If Tony's there, you know what to do. Wait, Mum, I just got an email. I'll put it up on the screen. Marks, you fucking coward! You're fucking dead! Dead! You fucking hear me! Find him! I want him fucking dead. Where's Kayla? Where's Kayla? We'll get out of here! Now! You fucking can't hide, Marks. You're fucking dead. You and me, Keats did fuck all to deserve that. You're fucking dead! Find him! He seems to be a bit upset about something. We need to get this under control. All right then. Let's get going. Be careful. Hello. Welcome to the Anthony Sharp Modern Art Collection. Named after yours truly, and entrusted in perpetuity to the people of London by one of their own. I'll be your guide throughout your visit. Scallywag in my younger days. But I always had a passion for art. When I was 12, me and my mates painted a mural on the wall of the local chip shop. The owner, recognizing the obvious quality of the work, decided to give us regular payments to maintain the artwork. Other local business owners soon entered into a similar arrangement.
still have an image of me. I know that. Working class lad turned property developer. They think all this art stuff is an affectation. That somehow I'm putting it on. But really, it ain't. I know there's more to life than money. Art. Love. The next exhibit is anamorphic. That means if you change perspective, you'll see something quite different. To get the most out of it, you just need to keep moving around, altering how you look at things. A bit like life, really, in my experience. the short straw then you're not big phil again one and only he likes doing the night shift says he can catch up on his heads <laughs> bollocks baron tell me you've forgotten again uh, no i haven't year the titanic sunk What are you hiding in there, Tony? So Charlie knows the situation. This isn't the old Tony. This is something different. It's Charlie, Mum. He gets it. His crew is solid. Fucking loons, to be honest. She'll be safe with him. Also, he's brought in more people. Serious people. Tony's got money, weapons, even more men now. We've got to match him. We will, Mum. Don't worry. How about you? How'd you get on? There's some sort of vault in the centre of the gallery. Might be something in it. Probably where he keeps his fucking ego. Yeah. Reckon you can get in there? Forget I said that. Charlie's men. Right. I need to marshal the troops. Make sure everyone's on the same page. I should only be a couple of hours. Get into that vault and see what you can find. And boys, be careful. Yes, Mum. Ah, all right. So, how do we do this? There's only one guard on duty, Big Phil. Heavy sleeper by all accounts. One guard? Yeah. Well, it is supposed to be an art gallery. What are you two waiting for? Well, go on then, fuck off. Come on then, let's go and see some art. Well, I didn't tell you, I posed for a live drawing class once. That was interesting. Whispering is much more prominent to the human senses than just talking quietly, yeah? You what? The frequency... Okay, don't whisper, just talk quietly, yeah? Okay? Come on, let's go. Ooh, look. Art. Huh. I suppose. This is very... tall. <laughs> it's taken them ages to set these up. Mm. Look very sturdy now, does it, Ryan? Go on. Use of that special forces stealth there, mate. 
Oh, mind you, I think it's an improvement. <laughs> oh. Come on, let's get to the vault. your hands. Oh. <laughs> Hold tight for the Mark's crew! <laughs> yes! <sighs> Whoa. Well, that is good, though, you've got to admit. Yeah, that's, that is pretty impressive. <laughs> <sighs> right, come on, we've got a job to do. This is awesome! Wait, check it out! Move them around! Ah, <laughs> oh, this is a tune! Wait, we should start a band! Yeah, but you're tone deaf. Your mum's tone deaf? Nick, your <laughs> mum's my mum. Yeah, what's your point? <laughs> you know what? Your dancing's actually pretty shit. Fuck you! DJ ever. Hold tight, DJ Subpar. MC Middling. And the crew. Got a mission to complete. Yeah, all right. Well, that was banging, though. Inside the rave! <laughs> Come on, then, let's go. Creepy and weird. Yeah, isn't it? What are you doing? <laughs> Why are you creeping up on me? Oh, what? Then they teach you how to defend yourself in the army. Oh, shut up. But Tony's got a thing about mannequins.
twice, mate. I got you twice. All that training. <laughs> Don't worry, I'll protect you. <laughs> Come on. I'm going for the classic uh, goatee and spectacles. I bet I can guess what you're going to do. <laughs> <laughs> How much do you think this shit's worth? Probably more now. <laughs> yeah. yes. uh, what we need, you see, is a, is a splash more colour, like so. <laughs> Have you seen this? Whoa! <laughs> Whoa! Now, that is amazing. Yes, yeah, all right. Seriously, that is one of the best things I've ever seen. <laughs> Have they done that? Oh, must be computers. Yeah. Is this it? Yeah. Let's get inside, find out what Tony's hiding. Yeah. After you, obviously. What are we looking for then? Clues, evidence, anything that'll tell us what Tony's up to. Hey, Tony Shark.
Yeah, there's loads of stuff here. You find anything? Nah, just a load of bullshit paperwork. Hang on a minute. Smile for the camera. Huh. Think you want to do something about that? Yeah, the power box is over there. Okay, leave this to me. Camera's down. Nice one, mate. That's interesting. What you got? Delivery notes, invoices, and at first glance it all looks normal, but there's something not quite right here. No, it's not right, because it's a front. It's exactly how Dad started. What, distribution? Yeah. Distributing what, though? Drugs? Guns? Nah, that's old Tony. Yeah, nah, this is something different. How do you get it off and running so quickly? Oh, someone must be backing him. Might explain why he's been so cocky of late. Huh. But who? What ports is he using? No, he's not. He's going through Falstead. The airfield? Yeah. He's got airports already. How do we not know about that? I don't know. No, this is good. Yeah. It's exactly what we came for. Oh, come on, let's get out of here and let Michelle do some maths. Maths? Well, you know, run some computer models or some shit. I don't know what she does. Fuck me. Nick Marks, criminal mastermind. Hey. What, do you think she's a maths teacher? It's not my field of expertise, You must think mate. she's a maths oh, teacher. Well, you just come she on. sorts your life out, yeah, mate. Well, she so does everything. Mom, so does you. <clears throat> so the gallery's a front. Yeah. Michelle's been looking into it. She's convinced there's more. Well, that's clever. But hey, this is your family business, way. Right? Take some arrangement, though. You need serious contacts. We're talking years. Sounds like you admire him. <laughs> but why distribution? Narcotics? Money? No. Mm, uh... So what's he moving? That's certainly not his shitty art. <laughs> This way, man. Right, we'll get back to the safe house. We'll talk to Michelle and... Oh, my God, what is that? <laughs> oh, hang on, hang on, hang on. Massive pictures of Tony and a paint gun. I mean, it'd be rude not to, wouldn't it? <laughs> <laughs> Got it, yes. Range is clear, Sergeant. You may fire when ready. Decorate this terrible asshole, would you? Oh, yes! Ooh. Oh, nice one. Oh, Tony's gonna love this. Oh, brilliant. Brilliant! Go on, go on, get that bit, get that bit. Oh, yes! Oh, he's gonna kill you. <laughs> Hang on. One for the family album? Say cheese. Why, <laughs> 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 oh, that was brilliant. <laughs> Tony is going to be living it. Hang on. Hang on. <gasps> Shit, it's him. What do you know about the airfield? Falstead. Mm, it's just outside London. Mostly freight. Standard stuff. Not one of yours? Not as far as I know. Might have been in the past, but not now. Okay. Falstead airfield. Everything. Do I have to do this myself? Okay. Yeah, thanks.
Now. We need to talk about Friesen. <laughs> I haven't had that much fun in years. That was brilliant. I imagine the look on his face when he walked in. When he walked in, it's all absolutely <laughs> livid. Mate, he's a total prick. Oh, he's such a little bit of a prick. Just shut the fuck up! Charlie's men are gone. They are dead. It was a massacre. I can't find Mum. My mum was with Charlie. I have looked everywhere for her. She's missing. Oh, it's her. Mum. I saw you outside a gallery. Having a good laugh, weren't you? Well, I've got a good one for you. I've got your mum. Still laughing now. I swear, if you fucking <laughs> touch... Let me talk to the soldier. I'm listening. You want to see your mum again? Come and get her. Friesen Towers. Yeah. How do I know she's there? Stay away, Ryan! Come alone! <laughs> Fuck! Fucking bastard. I'll rip his fucking head off. Friesen Towers is due for demolition. It's a trap. Of course it is. But we're going anyway. Come on, let's go. You're listening to Prime FM, first choice for London. I that long. Just need to use my tools. The funeral took place today of Keith Sharp. Mr. Sharp, known popularly as Keach, died suddenly of a suspected coronary. Keach, together with his brother Anthony, came to prominence in the early 1990s when they purchased and subsequently developed the Keywood estate in Gunnersbury. He is survived by that his wife Chloe and son Edward. Just need to grab my tools. London Zoo are celebrating a new arrival. Moo Moo the Panda nice has given birth to a bouncing Line up boy. The right. youngster's name, the which was pin. chosen by online poll, will be Pandy McPanda Face. All right, on to the next pin. A bit more. Nice job.
Mum's here, somewhere. We'll find her. I'll take the other block. Stay in radio contact. Roger that. I'll head to the main tower. <laughs> 